results by floor area or volume. For appropriate variables within Vista Pro, you can now divide by area and by volume. Using the synopsis to view results for heating plant loads as an example, the default view is in kilowatts, however new functionality is available when you click the details checkbox. The options are selected in the division column via the drop down and if open the results will automatically update. This is a huge time saver as previously you would have had to carry out some formatting in Excel to achieve results by floor area or volume for every room in your building. Processing results for room cooling or heating loads is now much more efficient. This new feature works for other results analysis options. Fixed colour scaling in Vista Pro. All charts within Vista Pro identify the room selected and variable by a specific colour. If you select further zones within your browser to review results, the colour differs each time. This is not always ideal if you're trying to compare a single variable on a series of charts. And so, as a user request, we've implemented new functionality within the Chart Preferences option on the Settings Toolbar menu, which now provides the user the ability to persist variable colours when a single room is selected. You can also set these custom colours here. Now, when you select a single room, and two variables, you can see heating load and air temperature shown in different colours. If you then select a different room with the same variables, the colour persists. This is useful when you copy the graphs as images to a report. You can now compare variables for different rooms. The colours stay the same, making this easier to view. If multiple rooms are selected on the same graph, the changing colour approach is still appropriate so that you can distinguish between each room. Waterside Network A new feature for viewing Apache HVAC results means that clicking on any waterside item in the browser will immediately make the switch to displaying the waterside network. Clicking on the waterside label at the top of this section of the tree in Vista Pro or on any top level waterside branch such as chilled water loops now provides users with immediate feedback regarding a move to the waterside view and away from the airside view. It also takes the user immediately to the first active waterside loop or component in that section of the tree. This provides direct access to the results view for the first loop of any given type. So just one click is required to bring up the view of the first active chilled water loop on the tree. This also works in Apache HVAC. To find out more about the new features in the VE, visit www.iesve.com/ve2018.